Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a different kind of video for you guys. I haven't done one on my channel just yet, but I happen to have a couple of happy mail things that I've kept and haven't used yet, so I figured I would do a little haul for you guys. So these are things that I've picked up in the last couple of months, probably just between July and August. And there were also a couple purchases in between that I won't be able to show you because I used them right away. So first off, I have Bubba Bear Studios and I used the coupon code of one of her PR girls who is Sarah Jane. And so her code is on here, um, but I'll show you her Instagram somewhere on screen right now. So this is the sampler that comes with it. This is because I did use Sarah Jane's um, coupon code. So if you use the coupon codes of different, um, different PR girls, you'd get a different sampler. So this was the reason why I purchased from Boba Bear Studios right now. I do have a couple of things from Boba Bear Studios, but I haven't purchased in a while. I really needed this one. So this is the sheet. So it is the I Need Space Girl. And so apparently this is the very first time that this has ever even been made into an actual sheet of its own. It was always just on samplers and whatnot. And literally this is me. Like I am such an introvert. Like I just need my space all the time. Like just leave me alone, literally. And then this is the Oh No Headache. This was also released, I believe the same day as I Need Space Girl. And so I just picked it up anyways because I get migraines pretty often, and so I thought it'd be cool to pick one of these up. Next I have this kit, which is the Love is in the Stars kit. I actually saw this a while back, but I never had the chance to pick it up. But because I was already picking up a couple of things, or those two things, I figured I'd get something else. I've never actually used Bubba Bear Studios um, kits before, but I do love the uniqueness of her art. Obviously, Jessica of BBS does design her own stuff. She um, draws them herself. So, yeah. So, this is the full box sheet. Um, washi, glitter headers, date covers. Some half boxes. Headers and icons and whatnot. Checklists. See, I just love how unique that is. Like, I don't think I would ever see anyone else do something similar to this. Yeah, so it's just a smaller kit, but that was my purchase from Boa Bear Studios. The next shop I have is a new to me shop, and it's actually a relatively small shop. So these are from Happy Dias Stickers, and this is a shop that is actually from Thailand. And so this is the card that comes with it. It's just stamped on, and I love the little quote that it says on here. I don't know if you could read it, but it says, be so happy that when others look at you, they become happy too. And that's just such a cute thing to say. It's it's a very good thing to live by. So I thought I'd show you guys that. But so this shop, I happened to find a bunch of food stickers at. There's just a cool theme that she has going on. So for this one, let me zoom you in real quick. There. So these are sandwich stickers. And you can see there's like a little flag with a little panda. I don't know if you could see that. Let me focus in on that real quick. There you go. Yeah, so that, and then I have these pizza stickers. Uh, let me refix the focus. There you go. Um, pizza stickers, and then they also have little panda ears. You probably can't see it at this rate, but there's actually a little face like in the crust, or well, right here, and it's the little panda also. Next, I have Boba, and as you can tell, she is keeping up with that theme. I absolutely love that. It's very on-brand, and it's pretty unique. I haven't seen anyone do this prior to her. You guys know I love my tacos, and so I had to pick this one up. It's a panda shell, so it has the ears, and it has a little Mexican hat. Um, the front of the taco also has a slight face on it. This, this was the reason I bought from this shop in the first place. So I was looking for stickers that would represent Korean barbecue and this is just so adorable. So the little grill is also panda shaped. Um, here's a sampler that came with the order. It's a freebie. 
um, there's a couple of things on here that I wish I actually picked up. I wish I picked up these two, which are more breakfasty type stickers. I absolutely love brunch. There's also this other sandwich one, which the actual sandwich itself is shaped like a panda. I think that's probably a burger, actually. But yeah, so she has a bunch of different characters, as you can see from here. They're kind of drawn all differently, but they're all equally unique and cute. So also picked up a couple of other things. So this girl's name is Lola. This one is just her drinking wine kind of happily. This is Lola doing some meal prepping or cooking. This is also Lola and this one's one where she's kind of having a migraine as you can see. That theme runs through this entire haul. And this one's just an excited Lola. It's kind of like fangirling or something. And then this one, her character is called Maya. So like I said, there are different styles. Um, this one is for silhouettes and like shop owner stuff. It's just a full-on sampler of a bunch of things that I could totally use. Um, yeah, so that's my haul from Happy Daya Stickers. Like I absolutely love that I found this. Uh, because it does come from Thailand, it did take a little longer than usual, obviously, to take um, or to ship here. She shipped it literally a day after I ordered, but it didn't get to me until maybe two weeks or so. It spent a quite long time in customs, and obviously that is not the shop owner's fault, but just in case you decide to order from her, be sure to be aware of shipping times. Next, I have a... Coffee Monsters Co. sticker haul. So let me zoom out for this, just or I'll do it later for the kit. So this is the sampler that comes with the kit. It's just a little freebie. has a couple of emojis, to-do header, and just this quarter box with the little emoji on the side. That is so cute. Next is this sheet. This is the wine time emojis. These are ice cream emojis. I mean, I know it's kind of late now that I'm hauling this because... Um, well, summer is almost over, but it doesn't mean you can't eat ice cream anymore. Like, you eat ice cream year-round anyways. This is gadget doodles. So these are just a couple of gadgets. They're mixed, so it's laptops, phones, iPads, TVs, chargers, and it's just coffee. Um, I bought it mainly to have more, like, random gadget stickers because I'm such a techie. I have a bunch of random gadgets at home. Um, yeah, so I figured I need like the charger because I'm really bad at keeping things charged like my iPad when I'm designing and stuff like that. So yeah, I got bubble tea stickers. Um, I really like boba. I haven't been getting boba as often as I used to, but I wanted variety with my boba stickers. Here is a Planner Girl's Desk. I've seen this from Helen of the Coffee Monsters Co. for a while now. I've wanted to pick it up, but I just haven't had enough stuff to order that I haven't gotten the chance to pick it up. So that's how I usually want to order. It's I don't really want to pick something up if I'm only there for one thing. I'd want to be able to pick up a couple other things. So that, and then this is also a Working Girl's Desk. Uh, if you guys didn't know, I do work 9 to 5. I'd probably use this occasionally for work if it's like a pretty busy day or something like that. But I also wanted to use it for whenever I'm working on the shop. It's just really cool. So these are like half box size sheets so it could just take up some room if you needed to. And this is the reason why I picked up um, a haul from the Coffee Monsters Co. in the first place. So this is the Love Letters kit. It is a fall themed kit. And if you didn't know yet, Helen paints all of these herself. It is so amazing. Like, I can't even. So this is just the... Oh, so I got the deluxe version of this kit. So this is why this sheet came in with it. So it's the washies and like headers or date covers. And it comes with a couple emojis with it. This also comes with a deluxe kit. It's just some glitter headers, sidebar stuff, TV stickers. Y'all, these full boxes. Like, can we talk about these full boxes? I don't know yet when in fall I'm going to want to use this, but I think I might even try to use it the first week. We'll see. Y'all, this is amazing. Like, 
I just want to stare at this forever. Helen, you did quite an amazing job as always with this and I cannot wait to use this. This is the functional sheet. I kind of can't fit it and I don't really want to zoom out at this rate. But yeah, I love that she has flags in them. I find that kind of unique because I don't find a lot of kits that have different shaped flags like this. These are the checklists. I love the little accents that she added on there. Sorry if it's like going out of frame. I'm not paying attention as much as I normally do like with Plan With Me's. But yeah, I love the colors of this kit so much. And these are the half boxes, quarter boxes, and a couple washies. Some headers, little things, more quarter boxes, um, Bill do. And that's it. So the order also comes with this super cute summer um, postcard. And it's also the card where you use to put your beans, which after this, I am totally removing all the beans and putting them on here. So that's my Coffee Monsters Co. order. So next I have a order from Little Miss Papery. Like if you guys have seen my plan with me, you would know that I use Little Miss Papery quite often. Little Miss Papery was actually the first um, shop that I bought kits from. And this was like almost two years ago now probably. So that's super cool. So it comes with this, um, this postcard that says let it hurt then let it go. Yeah, so let me grab this first because the freebies right here. So I picked up the summer night kit and obviously summer is about to be over and I'm actually going to use this in a plan with me really soon. She used to use these as like sneak peeks but it is really cool that it comes with the kit itself instead. So there's the freebie and then these are the base kit. So one side has like all these icons and other functional. Sorry, this sheet is a lot bigger than the ones I've shown you before. So this has all of those things, and then these are just some half boxes, quarter boxes, sidebar things, headers. And then also I picked up horizontal boxes. So this was actually on purpose. I do this quite often. I don't remember who I first saw do this, but I think it might have been Nia, who is Nia Creates, who's like, my BFF, you're probably watching this, so hello there. But... Um, this is the summer night kit and so it has like summer nights and don't quit your daydream. I love that Brittany adds like a couple of quote boxes in here. But so I decided to do horizontal boxes from Brittany stickers for a while now because she does allow you to get things a la carte. And um, it is cheaper that way if you don't use like the full kit, which I don't. So I use these because it allows me to use all of the full boxes of the kit but not take up too much room that I can't like do things more functionally. So I love mixing that up. And also it comes with more quarter boxes. I think this might be an older format. Actually, no, it's probably new. Um, but I do love that it comes with all these quarter boxes. I am so team quarter box and half boxes. Like they're my favorite things in like um, kits aside from like these functional word stickers. But yeah. And so this kit, this next one is called Fall Bliss. Um, I did pick up a couple of fall things. Ooh, looks like this one I picked up the mini kit. So this is the freebie that comes with it. So it's the exact same aside from like the paper and the colors. So this is the base kit, which you've seen the format already. Sorry, I'm just going to pan on that so you can see it. Yeah. These are the full boxes. Because I did get the mini kit, these are the vertical boxes. So if you could see, let me just compare the boxes so you see what I'm talking about. These boxes are slightly shorter. So you can see the Summer Nights boxes are shorter than the Fall Bliss ones. And yeah, I just love using that more on kits. Um, I don't mind like the taller ones that are meant for vertical. I just like you know, mixing it up and being able to experiment and do things slightly unconventionally. Yeah, and then these are the date covers, some half boxes, and then date dots, and also the checklist up here. And then this is the washi sheet. Yeah, so it comes with like the bottom washi and it comes with other strips that you could use these in a horizontal, I believe. And then it comes with these. Yeah. 
So that's my order from Little Miss Papery. So this last shop that I have, um, a lot of people were actually really surprised that this was my first order from this shop because it's super popular. But I have my reasons why I haven't ordered from this shop. So this one is from Scribble Prints Co. Yep, this was my first order to Scribble Prints Co. And the main reason why is because her stickers are always on glossy and I used to really not like glossy. I mean, I love it for its vibrancy, but I always hated it for like taking photos because if you didn't have like the right lighting, like everything just bounces off the stickers because of how shiny it is. So yeah, but so similar to um, Little Miss Papery, the freebie that comes with the kit is formatted to match the kit. So here, there's just actually munchkins on here and they're made by Once More With Love, but they are recolored by um, Scribble Prints Co. And they also are cut slightly differently. Like they're cut way closer to the actual munchkins than um, Once More With Love does them, which is cool. And I don't, yeah, these stickers are actually available on Marge's shop as well like these exact ones, but obviously the colors are different. But yeah, so that's super cool that you get to get matching um, munchkins with it. And then here there's also this freebie, which is just a blue themed kit. I don't know this dino's name, but this is one of the newer stickers that Scribble Prints Co. has released. They're like the dinos. And yeah, I absolutely love blue, so this is super cool. So this is the kit that I ordered. It's called Love Pug, and if you guys know me, um, you know I absolutely love pugs like pugs are my most favorite animal of all time um yeah so these are the full boxes i can't wait to use this kit i'm gonna use this in a couple of weeks actually um i love that it's very like september like the purples and just the greens like it's very like transitional fall so here are the um little things headers some half boxes quarter boxes um, the checklist, icons, weekly stuff, um, weekend banner. Also, I did pick up the um, mini kit for this um, because I don't typically do um, no white space or anything. So mini kits are usually enough for me. These are the washi strips, bottom washi. There's also some deco on here, which is so adorable. Like both the black pugs and like the fawn pugs are so adorable. Oh my god. And so I also picked up this extra sheet. So it is the glitter sampler for the Love Pug kit, which this is just a, um, these are just glitter headers, appointment labels, some flags, and then some um, quarter boxes. I figured that since I was trying Scribble Prints Co. for the first time that I'd pick up a little bit more than just the um, kit that I wanted. And I figured this was a good way to just add on so that I get like the more Scribble Prints Co. feel without having to get the full kit, which I wouldn't use completely. So that was my haul. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you like more hauls, I can totally do more of that. I have a couple more orders coming in. Um, let me know down below in the comments if you want to see more of that. But yeah, I can't wait to use these kits and everything in my next couple of spreads. So if you want to see them, um, be sure to subscribe and you'll see some of these kits in Plan With Me's in the upcoming weeks. And so thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.